Oh shit, Buck Nation. We gotta go to work this weekend. Stand up. Let's go. It's division rivalry week and it's hate week number four. Let's go get them pussycats. That's right, Buck Nation. It's time to fight. It's time to make the Panthers double check themselves. Reality check. You underestimating us. T Money, Eight Camel Toes, y'all are underestimating us. Sure, we may have gone and had a bad game last Sunday, but what happened the last time we had a bad game? We turned around, got the W, and walked out with the win. I didn't even know I just said that. Anyways, I'm not scared of this team, and I'm being 100% real. I'm not saying, you know, that this that their team is not a good team. They're 3-0. and They're obviously good enough to be 3-0. and but let's think of who they beat to go 3-0. They beat Jacksonville, they beat Houston, and they beat New Orleans. One of the two, uh, one of the three teams I mentioned, we didn't beat. Yeah, we didn't beat them. We shot ourselves in the foot. You know, we made mistakes. Oh, well. Move on. The Panthers think they're high and mighty because they've won two division titles in a row. I'll give you all the first one. I'll give it, I'll give it to you. It was a fluke, though. I thought or it wasn't a fluke. I'll give it to you. I thought it was a fluke, though. That's what I meant to say. I thought it was a fluke. Y'all turned right around. You know, even though anybody in that division last year could have won it. Even my Bucks at one point had a chance to win it even at 1-7. and seven. So that tells you how good the entire division was last year. So, I mean, that's it. And the, the last year was definitely a fluke. And, you know, you look at their team. We're all different teams this year. The Bucks are obviously a different team. Okay? Sure, we may have gone on to a 1-2 and two start. But you know what? One and two is still not horrible. There's still a lot of be football, a lot of football to be played. This season is not over. I'm not Lakers fans fan just because I get my ass whooped. I'm saying this season's over. You know, I still got faith in my team. Now, if we're playing like we were last Sunday, you know, ten weeks from now, I don't know. I may cash it in. Who am I kidding? I'll never cash it in. I always think my team's got it, got it for Sunday. Every day, all day, 24-7. Because that's the fan I am. And this Sunday, I'm telling you, we are going to give the Panthers hell. This is why. They're, our defense is going to be able to shut down Cam Newton. I really believe so. I think they're going to step it up. I think we finally going to have a pass rush figured out. Because we finally had a pass rush figured out Sunday. Okay? We're going to have to fix the running game. Uh, fi fix to stopping the running game. We obviously didn't stop it last week. We did well against the pass. I'm not afraid of these this team. The only thing I'm afraid of is our offensive line buckling under that Panthers defensive line. And really, the offensive line did well considering J.J. Watt didn't barely even touch Jameis Winston on Sunday. That is why I believe we can win this game. Because I think the offensive line stepped up. I think we'll be able to run the ball on Sunday. I think Jameis is going to have a better game. I think Evans is going to bring his hands. And I think Vincent Jackson is going to be able to keep his feet down. And so help me, God, Lord, Hall, Lord Almighty, Kyle Brenza better have a foot on Sunday. At least an accurate foot. That was ridiculous. Four missed field goals. I love eating chicken wings, but I don't want to eat chicken wings the way I did on Sunday. No, 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 senor. No, 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 senorita. No, 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 you muchacho. No, 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 muchacha. That's right. We got to go in this Sunday. We got to make sure that the Panthers know who we are. That we are not just some kick-around toy team like we have been for the past two years. Because you know what? We're not. We have been in every single game despite the Tennessee game so far this year. We led 95% of the way against New Orleans. We led most of the game against, uh, at least until half and into the third quarter against the Texans. And we were still only one point behind for the majority of the game until Alfred Blue put it away and our defense was tired because our offense wasn't moving the ball. We're going to win on Sunday, goddammit, and I could put, I'll put a thing on it. I'll put, you know, whatever. Got to be careful with my words there. I won't put anything on it, but I'll put something on it. Bucks over the Panthers any day. 
fucks over anybody any fucking day. We got a chance, Buck Nation. It's time to go to work. That's what the hard helmet's for. Division rivalry. It's time to get pumped up. It's time to go. Because I'm ready for this. I'm ready to rebound. I'm ready to laugh at all them stupid motherfucking pussycat fans on Sunday. That's right. Bucks go win on Sunday. I'm out. Fuck Carolina.